Well, fellers, it seems I've done it again. I have randomly selected some interesting sites for you guys to watch and hopefully enjoy, maybe use, who knows. Anyway, let's dive right in here and um, let me know what you think. The first website I want to talk to you guys about today real quick, innerbody.com, which I think is pretty cool. I mean, you look up health stuff on the internet, right? And it's like, ah, you're going to die. You have 15 different kinds of cancer. <sighs> you know, this one is a little more informed. <laughs> they have like um, articles and stuff written by doctors all over the place. Uh, it's got kind of a nutritional focus. You can even uh, explore anatomy. I, I, here's the here's the cardiovascular system. I know. I mean, it's got like all kinds of different stuff you can look at if you're curious as to your digestive system, figuring out exactly what hurts and where stuff goes. And holy cow, I thought this was pretty cool, cool enough to share. And it's got just like facts, just just the facts here's where this is and here's where it does kind of site and i kind of dig that so i wanted to uh to share this site with you uh inner body i-n-n-e-r-b-o-d-y dot com uh you can get online therapy too if you want i mean resources and all kinds of stuff i just you know i'm not particularly a health nut maybe i should be but um but yeah i wanted to share this this one with you guys the uh the second one is completely different <laughs> uh png file is basically a file where you have your graphic on a clear background right so it removes the background so you can put your graphic basically on anything and you don't have to worry about the white square kind of thing and this is a website um, that will do it for free, which is pretty cool. Here's some examples. These are the trending transparent PNG art. So that's basically what a PNG file is. It just means the uh, uh, the back the background is gone. Um, and this can be useful for thumbnails or if you're any kind of artsy person out there that wants to uh, transfer one file to another, things like that. Uh, I thought this was interesting enough to share with you guys. I'm not gonna click on too much stuff because it's pretty simple, you get the idea. But um, man, you know, if you have like a store, like, uh, uh, like a Zazzle store or something like that, some uh, a site like this can come in handy. Believe that, it's, it's good stuff right here. Uh, this is clean PNG. C-L-E-A-N-P-N-G dot com. The next one that I'm going to show you. <laughs> Have you ever been on a site and the site just stops working and you're like, what is is this down for everyone or just me? Well, this is down for everyone or just me dot com. <laughs> I know. And uh, this will really help out your paranoia if you're having trouble with your internet or if you're not sure what's going on and something isn't working and you don't know why you just kind of type in the url you know click or just me and uh and it'll tell you it'll tell you in fact it tells you outages happening right now recent outages and problems you can oh okay well this site had a problem recently so it's not just me and it'll tell you which I think is great. As this is a good idea, and it's so simple. There's really nothing for me to click on and show you. It's just so simple. This is great. This is, again, um, downforeveryoneorjustme.com, which is just a little quick reference that you can check just so you don't go crazy online if something isn't working. I think that's neat. Uh, the last one I want to show you guys in this video, how long to beat. You know, if you're not a hardcore gamer, maybe you're just a casual gamer, and you want to get a game, but you don't want to spend, like, two weeks trying to finish the darn thing, which, you know, it happens. Uh, 
how long does it take to actually for a normal person to complete the game okay this will tell you you know portal 2 you can do it in uh eight and a half hours you know completionist which is completing absolutely every part of the game 21 hours i mean you know that kind of thing and it's got you know final fantasy uh 10 15 16 final fantasy 16 35 hours completionist 75 and it'll tell you so you know exactly how much time you're going to have to invest into completing this game which is i think a really good idea and i'm kind of a casual gamer i'm not really all that hardcore and something like this is helpful because i don't want to get i don't want to get caught up in something that's going to take me you know 900 hours to complete and be complicated and nah, i don't want to deal with all that nonsense so again this is how long to beat dot com which i think is a very interesting idea i like the premise of this site and i thought it was interesting enough to share with you fellers on the interwebs so there you have it there are my uh four videos for today i hope you fellers enjoyed those in, uh, interesting and nifty websites that i found all over the interwebs have an absolutely wonderful day tell your friends tell your enemies tell everybody about the llama and have a great day well folks looks like the video has ended i know i know i'm sorry too but there will be another one soon so you know thanks for watching i do appreciate you if you don't mind liking and sharing and subscribing and all that other great youtuber stuff kind of helps me out do appreciate that anyway you all have an absolutely wonderful day this has been llama and i am out